Hello and welcome to Select 10. In this video, we will count down the top 10 most watched Netflix original movies released in 2022. Netflix had a roller coaster year last year, with some great hits and big misses, but we're only going to be talking about the movies that were the most well liked and received millions of watch hours in the first month after their release. Now let's start the video. Number 10. Enola Holmes 2. First film got immensely popular due to its cast and, of course, the curiosity of seeing Enola Holmes on screen, and it was worth it, as we got a kind of perfect origin story for Enola. Just like the first movie, Enola Holmes 2 was a great success, garnering 158 million hours of viewing time in its first month. In the new film, Enola takes the step to launch her own detective business in order to continue solving mysteries and crimes. Unfortunately, she did not receive the positive feedback or cases she had hoped for until a desperate matchstick girl offered her first case to look for her sister, who had been abducted. The best part is that we got to see a bit more of Henry Cavill's story than we did in the last film, while overall the first one was better. Number 9. Senior Year. I suppose some viewers may not even be aware of this movie. But that didn't stop it from being one of the most watched movies on Netflix, with 167 million hours seen in the first four weeks of release. The story is about Stephanie, the most popular girl in school, the cheerleading team captain, and a strong candidate for prom queen. But, when she fell from the top of the cheerleading pyramid and went into a coma, everything changed. Twenty years later, at the age of 37, Stephanie finally emerges from her coma and makes the decision to return to her school and assume the position as the school's superstar, while still determined to compete for the prom queen crown. The movie was quite average, with some good humor, and it's worth watching for the chemistry of its key characters. Number 8. The Man from Toronto. It is an action comedy film, directed by Patrick Hughes. The movie stars Kevin Hart as Teddy and Woody Harrelson as The Man from Toronto. Teddy is a striving fitness enthusiast who happens to be in the wrong place at the wrong time, while the man from Toronto is a famous contract killer. The strange adventure starts when Teddy makes a mistake and goes to the incorrect rental home, where a guy is being held prisoner, who mistakenly assumes Teddy is the man from Toronto. What follows next is a hilarious action adventure, during which Teddy and the actual The Man from Toronto interact, beginning their destined and hopeless journey together to prevent the bigger conspiracy that might possibly cause another global conflict. Honestly, the plot is nothing new, it is a typical action thriller, however, what makes it stand out and exciting to watch are Kevin Hart and Woody Harrelson, who act as the heart and mind of the film. Despite receiving negative reviews, this film has been viewed 170 million hours in its first month of release. Number 7. The Tinder Swindler. It is a true crime documentary film about a con artist who used the dating app Tinder to approach women and persuade them into giving him loans that he would never be able to pay. He used money he obtained from other ladies he had previously scammed to lure new women with extravagant gifts in an effort to gain their trust. His biggest trick, though, is to send the same messages and photographs to each woman, making it seem as though he is being pursued by his enemies and needs money to escape. While believing what he said, the victims frequently borrowed funds to support him. In the meantime, after tricking his latest victim, he uses the money to attract new ones, while mailing fake transfers to previous victims, claiming to have returned their money. But his crimes come to light when some of his victims decide to pursue him. This movie's length is the main drawback, aside from that, it's incredibly intriguing and informative, which is why it had been watched 172 million hours in the first month. Number 6. The Sea Beast. This film is without a doubt among the greatest animated films of the past year. With a fascinating script and great animation, the film was able to generate 190 million viewing hours in the first month of its premiere. The movie is an epic fantasy action story that takes place during a period when the seas were dominated by fearsome creatures and monster killers were honored as warriors. The main story centers around beast hunter Jacob Holland and his crew, who set out to find the mysterious red bluster creature. While a young girl named Macy Brumble had quietly boarded their ship, developed an incredible connection with a terrifying sea monster, and later joined Jacob on his mission when he discovered her on the ship. This is by far the most gorgeous animated sea adventure I've seen in recent years, and many grown-up people are skeptical of animated content, but just so you know, this movie can be enjoyed by individuals of all ages. Number 5. Hustle. Probably the most underrated Netflix movie of 2022 that you should add to your viewing list. 
It is a sports drama film centering on NBA recruiter Stanley as he meets and prepares a rough but promising basketball player, Bo Cruz, for the NBA playoffs. Bo Cruz, on the other side, has a bad history, but his new journey begins when he bonds with Stanley off the court because of their shared enthusiasm for the game and desire to succeed in both basketball and life. Both of them have a sense of revived motivation, and Stanley makes it his goal to prepare Bo for the NBA as he thinks they both have what it takes to succeed. If I had to sum up this film in one line, I would say that it is a heartwarming story of faith and passion for the sport, with the message that anything is possible if you put in just enough effort. In its first month, the movie attracted a stunning 198 million hours of viewership. Number 4. Purple Hearts. Well, this movie emerged out of nowhere and quickly gained popularity after its release. The plot centers on a marine, Luke, and an ambitious musician, Cassie, who decide to wed in order to take advantage of government benefits and pay off their loans. However, their pretended marriage takes a turn when Luke has an accident while on duty and returns home in a wheelchair. The boundary separating what is genuine and what is fake starts to blur quickly after this tragedy, leading to unplanned drama in their relationship and confusion on both sides about how they really feel about each other. But it must be noted that not everyone will enjoy this film as much as a romantic drama fan. Its 228 million hour record indicates that a fairly large audience liked it as it made it to the list of most watched movies. You may have heard of this movie, it was one of the most popular of 2022 and its release on Netflix helped to reach a wider audience that loved it. The film premiered on Netflix in May 2022, and it was reported in December that it had received 73 million hours, the highest viewership record for any Indian film. The film is an epic action story set in 1920, when the British were still in power, and follows a tyrannical ruler who forcibly kidnaps a young girl from the village in the neighborhood. After hearing about the tragedy, Ko Maram Beam, the defender of the tribe, promises to save the girl. While the British officials request the intervention of Rama Raju, a dedicated cop in the Indian Imperial Guards, to put an end to the situation. The only drawbacks are a conventional plot and a slightly lengthy runtime, which can be easily overlooked given the film's outstanding screenplay. All Quiet on the Western Front the story revolves around Paul and his friends, who join the German army, catching a thrill of loyal citizen love that eventually vanishes when they witness how warfare changes into hopelessness and panic as they struggle for survival on the battlefield. With 101 million hours of viewing in its first month, the film is now the second most watched non-English film of all time and has received many Oscar nominations. The first spot goes to Troll, which received 152 million hours of viewership in its first four weeks and is now the most watched non-English film of all time, surpassing Blood Red Sky. The Troll story revolves around Nora, a scientist, and army officials who must work together to defeat an ancient giant beast that was unintentionally awoken by a mining explosion on a Norwegian hillside. Don't expect much because it is just a decent but entertaining movie that has the usual elements of classic monster movies. Number 3. The Atom Project. Ryan Reynolds' Underground 6 was one of the most watched Netflix movies of all time, and now his new film, The Atom Project, which has received a massive 233 million hours of viewing in its first month, has become the sixth most watched Netflix movie of all time. The film depicts the story of time-traveling pilot Adam, who unintentionally returns to the year 2022, where he is required to join forces with his 12-year-old self to defend the planet from an enemy hellbent on obtaining a time-traveling technology developed by Adam's father. The film has it all, including a well-known cast, lightsabers, a vintage sci-fi feel, intense action, a few heartbreaking emotional scenes, and a delightful storyline that is completely worth your time. Number 2. The Grey Man. With a star-studded cast that includes Chris Evans, Ryan Gosling, and the directors of Endgame, records were bound to be broken. In fact, they were broken, as the film racked up an astounding 256 million hours of viewership and moved up to fifth place on Netflix's list of the most watched films of all time. The movie centers on Six, the most experienced CIA agent, who unwittingly digs up secretive information about the organization. To eliminate Six, a violent co-worker places a bounty on his life, sparking a global hunt by multinational mercenaries, willing to go to any length to eliminate Six. Overall, it is a non-stop stylish roller coaster ride from beginning to end, enhanced even more by the fascinating characters and spectacular locations. Number 1. Glass Onion. 
I guess this comes as no surprise, as The Knives Out was a unique murder mystery movie that drew in viewers from all genres with its gripping storyline. Even though Glass Onion may not match the first movie in terms of mystery plot, it has set an insane record of 273 million hours of viewing within its first month of release, making it the fourth most watched Netflix movie of all time. The plot centers on crime scene investigator Benoit Blanc, who is welcomed by a group of associates on a wealthy remote island, where they are celebrating their yearly reunion, thanks to billionaire Miles Braun. Similar to the first movie, each person at the gathering carries their own agendas, mysteries, and deceptions, which are gradually uncovered after one of the attendees drops dead, and Blanc takes over the interrogation, which makes everyone there a suspect. While the film is superior in every way, the soul of the Knives Out films lies in its mystery, which The Glass Onion lacks a little bit. It's not as great as the first Knives Out, but not everything needs to outshine the original. That's it for today, thank you for watching this video. And do subscribe our channel to see more videos related to movies and series suggestions.